marvellous day everybody get out and go for a scoot just a little bit windy here in Canberra anyway this was the old brake pad and as you can see there's still some meat on there I bought some new ones just now now I suspected the hydraulic fluid you know was the problem but uh, as it discovers as I've discovered that is the problem we got the new brake pads in there but what I'm doing fellas we're doing everything uh, my way sorry about the shadows but uh, we're putting some more fluid in there uh, we're just squeezing it in slowly and I am putting it in that stuff there so anyway it's bloody working I've got brakes now was going right in before that's full brake I reckon a couple of more squeezes of some fluid in there and we're good to go my little invention works a treat yeah so that's all it was guys uh, something with a bit of a small thread cut the end off it got the fluid into the uh, scooter and I tell you now we got some uh, back brakes that's it. This is as much as I need to press it now. So you can see the difference. The other one went right to the uh, handle grip. So now we got some. Uh, now we got something in there. That's good. Nothing's leaking. Anyway, we'll go with that. See what happens. Sitting here, just cleaning the. Uh, the old discs with a bit of but anyway there it is yeah so got a loose bolt there boys that's why it's always important to check over your gear give it a good thorough clean every now and again and you get to see what's uh what's loose and what's tight but that was pretty bloody loose to be honest did you see that move anyway Yeah, righto guys. Alright, well you all have a good one. Thanks for watching. I didn't really say goodbye, so I'll say it now. Cheers.